Hi, my name is Daniel Brown. I'm the senior pastor of Faith Community Church here in Bedford and also in Cambridge. I've been kindly asked and invited by my good friend and brother, Pastor Lloyd Crossfield, to come and share some words of wisdom for today. So here are my words of wisdom for today. The thought that I want to leave with you is simply this. We are called to produce and be fruitful. You know, Mahatma Gandhi once said, behavior is the mirror in which we display our image. Several thousand years earlier, Jesus puts it like this. You will know people by their fruit. You know, the word produce is usually associated with vegetation, that which comes from the ground. However, the word produce really describes anything that comes from an initial point, whether it be a seed, an idea, or some other starting point. You know, Psalms chapter 92, verse 12 to 13 says this, The righteous shall flourish like a palm tree. He shall grow like a cedar in Lebanon. Those who are planted in the house of the Lord shall flourish in the courts of our God. David stumbled across something very important. He realized that not only is the house of God a church building, but the house of God being the presence of God, the kingdom of God, the atmosphere of God. When we are planted in that, he says that we will produce, we will be fruitful, and we will be a glory to God as a result. Remember you are the body of Christ. You are his body. Whether it be a finger, whether it be an eye, eyelashes, whatever it is, you are part and parcel of the body of Christ. 1 Corinthians 12, 27 says this, now you are the body of Christ and members individually. You can't get away from the fact you make up the body of Christ. And you'll find that there is nothing about Christ, nothing about God, nothing about the Holy Spirit that is barren or unfruitful. Everything about Christ is fruitful. Everything about the Holy Spirit is productive. So if we're part of his body, by default, you've just got to accept it. You are called to be productive and fruitful. You're also called to be equipped. And not only are you called to be equipped, but you're also called to equip others. There is nothing more powerful than receiving or receiving a deposit that changes your life, enhances your life, develop your life in some way, shape or form. And then you then pass on that experience, that knowledge, that um, expertise onto somebody else and help them to become better. Because what, what's actually happening, not only are you receiving uh, a deposit that makes you a better person to produce and be fruitful, but actually you're passing that opportunity onto somebody else. And then that person also has an opportunity to become fruitful and productive.